great workout today. We were extremely heavy. Nick went up to um, 130. 130 on the, the dips, blasting all three heads with triceps. This, this is kind of, there we go, come on. Let's go. Boom. Yep. Come on. Yeah, two more, come on. This lift got is this. Uh, proven in uh, MRI studies to really hammer all three heads of the triceps. That's a very serious weight he is using. That's 130 pounds over Nick's body weight, the kind of weight that would res command respect from the prison yard to the Scotland yard. Let's go, Nick. Come on. Yeah. Two more, come on. You got it? Good. Stop, stop, stop. Now, okay, so we went We went to, uh, Nick went 130 pounds. That was four reps, 120 pounds, that was four reps. Now we're a cluster set. So you have five reps with 40 pounds over his body weight. We're going to rest 15 seconds with as many sets as possible. Our goal here is six. Anything better than that is just icing on the cake. Hold on, come on. Go! Went to the, the pull ups where we, we talked about the brachialis activation and your pause. At 15 degree, at 15 degrees, shy lock out and really hold it and squeeze it isometrically for three seconds. That's all of his body weight there too. 240 pounds now? Yeah, 240. Yes, yeah, 240. Gain weight. Gain weight like he's supposed to be. And the, the, we already know, I think that inch is already there now, but we still have another week, so if it's seven eighths of an inch, we'll get, we're okay. But we're gonna, we're gonna make, the beginning of the workout next week, we're gonna measure it, get that taped up and, and show the final win, lose or fail. It's been a hell of a journey, so we're going to decide to wrap it up. Today was a great workout. Great superset there. You saw the different exercises we did. So We would normally, we were going to think about changing a couple exercises up, but Nick's had a couple of little, he's had a couple of tweaks um, outside of the weight room. So what we're going to do here is just stick with what we know is going to feel okay here on the incline dumbbell curls. I mean, no better exercise to work the long head of your I bicep at that. that. One dumbbell? Yeah. But like the one and one quarter reps. Okay. What kind of weight is he? If I'm keeping my elbows really straight, yes, probably 70, 75. Let's go 70. Then. Right. We'll go eight reps like that, okay? Right. So what are we doing here? This is failure. Yeah. Super set with that. Yep. high rep today for his triceps, so we're going to really burn him out here. We're going to go 50, 40, 30, 20 on that dip machine over there. There's no need for stabilization or anything. It's just going to be all muscle. Right there.
add to that is you got to see we're we're trying. You know, we hope you guys have picked up if you picked up nothing else. We're trying not to be dogmatic. Maybe we're doing like just oh, okay. You got to bench close grips. If you do that, you get big triceps or you know barbell curls are the only way. No, there's a you got to do a variety of exercise, hit a bunch of different angles, variety of sets, reps, tempos, rep ranges, all that stuff to make your arms grow. And that's where people go wrong is they're you know they're so they're not open minded. You got to you know expand, learn, get better. Chinese say you live you know you learn something new, live a day longer. And um, you know I think Nick's definitely gonna live a day longer after today.